so far, within seven months, everything Biden said has said has been a complete lie. I'm not gonna say I told y'all so, but I told you so. Within the last year or so, within when our president Donald J. Trump was in office, they tried to impeach our president. I believe over three different times over nothing. But now we're in the time where we have a president that has lied about everything within the last seven months of him being in office. I mean, I mean, everything besides the point. It's way past if you're a Democrat or Republican at this point. I mean, to a certain degree, right? And this, and, and let me explain of kind of what I mean. You know, Biden took away all the police anyway. I'm talking of what's obvious, right? Everybody can see this. Like I say, it don't matter what party you you signed up for. You know what the business is just by looking at him speak at any given time. Last seven months and beyond, right? We all knew Biden wasn't all the way there, but y'all elected him anyway. But anyway, man, listen. Something else is going on, and I'm not quite, you know, I, I'm not a conspiracy theory type, but um, something is going on that we just don't understand and don't see or just don't know. I mean, let me say it like that. I feel it in my gut. I'm not making any claim. I'm saying that's my opinion because there's no way anybody, and this is my opinion, I'm trying to find the truth in bite. Right? I am legitimately trying to find the truth in this boy. And I can't find one. Everything he says has been a lie. He told all black folks last year exactly how he feels about black people. And y'all voted him in anyway. He didn't get mad at me and other black Americans for supporting our President Trump for the realness that he brought. I know half y'all out there secretly is wishing y'all would have just be a little bit still and see what Trump was talking. We need to get this guy out of office before he destroy our country. Listen, our country is very fragile at this point, ladies and gentlemen. I know everybody can see it. You ain't got to be into politics and know that. We just the Taliban, ISIS. Hey, America, they think we're the great Satan, right? Now they got a country. They got one of the biggest gangs in the world at this point. And your boy Biden helped him build it with $90 billion of military equipment. Unbelievable. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, the first thing to do while I'm talking about the political thing, first, seek God first. This is not a, enough to get you to understand that you need to seek him first. You just won't see it. You're blind. Get out of your feelings. Get out of the black thing, the white thing, or whatever thing that you in. You're a Christian. You already should know that has no validation in who we are as men and women and sons and daughters of Christ. This is a spiritual thing. This ain't got nothing to do with how tough we are, the tough they are, because it's obvious. We got a country that we gave $90 billion of military equipment to, right? $90 billion. They were on TikTok rapping with our AKs and our equipment and wrecking helicopters and, I mean, they're swerving Black Hawks. Something else is going on. And see God first and everything you ask for will be there. In his will, because this stuff that y'all see going on, is something else. And I'm not even gonna get into like I have on my other previous videos. If you haven't watched them, I just had to chime in on this on We Gotta Talk to Talk. By the way, I also, ladies and gentlemen, I have another car channel. I told your vision, like out of your vision. Come check me out on YouTube. It's my other channel. Um you know, I, I, it, it's a car channel. I'm in Vegas. We're going to be at different shows and stuff. I got a couple videos over there. Go over there and tell me what you think. Leave a comment, a like. You know, tell me what you think. We uh, we have a problem that we we need to really start focusing on other than the stuff that we're focusing on in our country that's tearing us apart, especially when it comes to us tearing our own family up within and allowing for enemies around the world to come and just destroy us. It's a good way 
to become a socialist co- country. If you don't know what that is, go look it up. As a matter of fact, and look at North and Korea. And that's that that's socialism. All the ladies and girls, or guys and girls, and the gyms and females. Go look that up. It is Matthew 6 33. Y'all and know and what it is with me. I will talk to you next video. Go check me out on Out of Your Vision. And like I say, seek God first. You know, put all the feelings aside, and I will talk to you on my next video.